Jasmine and you're watching Beauty Snaps with Preview.ph and the SM Store Beauty section. Here I'll be showing you some quick makeup hacks, tips and how-tos with some cool products from the SM Store Beauty section. So let's get started. Before applying colour, you want to make sure that you have soft lips with no cracks. So I'm making my very own lip scrub. It's super easy. Just clean out your old mascara wand and dip it in sugar and a creamy base such as honey, lip balm or a face oil. Now I'll just apply this mixture onto my lips. I'll gently rub in circles. And then we can wipe it off. There. Next up, let's get a little adventurous and try some lip art. Ombre and two-tone lips are probably something you've seen on the runway, but let me show you how easy it is to do. I like to start with a lip liner to make my lips look fuller and a little secret that I've learned is to gently warm the tip of the liner by rubbing it in between my fingers like this so it slides on smoothly. Let's start with ombre lips. All you need are two shades of lipstick that you want to fade into each other with a gradient looking effect. look I'm going to share with you a trick that I learned and that is to use a shimmery eyeshadow for a frosted effect. If you want another lip look that plays with multiple colours, a two-tone lipstick look is great too. Now what if your lipstick breaks while you're doing this look? It can happen if you apply too much pressure onto the lipstick. But don't panic, all you need to do is to get a lighter and gently melt the broken part of the lipstick. Apply it back onto the rest of the lipstick. I'll keep this in my freezer for a couple of hours and my lipstick should be as good as new. Now that we're done with our lip looks, I'll let you in on some lip secrets. Did you know that you can create your own lipstick shade by mixing your favourite eyeshadow? Know those big eyeshadow palettes with a hundred colours that you don't get to use? Mix them up for your own lip colour. Since we've been doing a lot on our lips this episode, why not complete the look by using a lipstick as a blush? First I want to take a drop of SPF and then get a matte lipstick and I can combine these two together to make a beautiful creamy blush and it's going to give an extra skin protection as well. Then I can just go ahead and dab this on my cheeks. There you have it. Don't forget to tag us on Instagram with your favourite lip art creations. All the products I use today are available at the SM Store Beauty section. They have the widest range of colours and textures for you to complete your makeup kit. Otherwise, the article for the step-by-step -step instructions for all the looks I did today are below this video. And I'll see you guys next time on the next episode of Beauty Snaps. Okay, never in the middle of a tape. I, oh, why? <laughs> You're watching Style Snaps. Beauty, Beauty Snaps. Oh, sorry. <laughs>